here is the outcome. <laughs> Mama Weezy channel. As you can see in the description down below, I will be preparing Sunday dinner. So don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, and don't forget to push that notification bell. Got my water running, so I'm about to wash the fish off. And as you can see, I'm gonna wash it off good. And these are the whitings. So I'm gonna get back with you after I finish wash the fish off good. All right. The whitings are all washed up and clean. So I'm about to add my seasoning on it and let it sit. Okay, I'm about to season up my fish, my whiting. So the first thing I will put on there is pepper, as you can see, black pepper, turn it over. Over, over. Nice and seasoned. The next, I will put my accent. Accent, as you can see, accent. Okay, put some accent on it. Many of y'all may do season y'all fish a different way, but it's okay. As long as it has flavor. Yeah. Okay, that's enough of that. And we have our salt. I have my salt in my container. I'm about to sprinkle it. Not too much. Turn it over. But I'm going to use Obey. Obey. Okay. Put it down. Throw it through. Put it in through and through. Through and through. to let this sit while I prepare the rest of my food. I will be back. Y'all see how seasoned it is? See how seasoned through and through I went? And so now I'm about to let it sit. Let that marinate in there. Put the onions, as you can see the light. Okay, my green peppers. Something nice. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna put, I might put some red peppers as well. Okay, there you 
um, the reason why I'm cutting this up, I'm going to put it in my fried cabbage that I'm going to prepare. cut up. I didn't cut up too much. I don't wash it off and all that. Now, as you can, now, as you can see, I didn't start cutting my cabbage up. Okay, I'm finished cutting my cabbage up. Now I'm about to take it over and get it washed up. Okay, my cabbage is all washed up. So let's sit right here and let it drain. Bacon. Fry it in the pot to go with my cabbage. I don't know if anyone uses bacon to season the cabbage, but that's what I do. Okay, I'm going with turkey bacon, a little soya, as you can see. Not too much salt. All right. Okay, hey, this is what the turkey bacon looks like. Okay, and I add the pepper along with the turkey bacon. Now I'm about to put the bag on it. Now I'm about to cook my cornbread swirl. the pan with grease the, the pan cooking pan with pan okay and I'm put the cornbread swirls on the pan I have 12 of them and you cook for about 14 to 17 minutes. Look at it. All done. Rice is all done. Fish all done. And the cornbread swirl all done. Here's the outcome. Everything's done. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Share and push that notification bell to see the next upcoming video.